Good afternoon and welcome back to midday. We're starting off looking at the current relative humidities below 50%, so it is on the low end side as of now. And with that being said, we have a fire danger statement that has been going on all week. It continues through this evening, and that's due to the relative humidities being low, but we don't have a red flag warning that deals with wind speeds a little bit higher, and for, day, for today, it'll stay pretty low. So temperature is pretty hot once again from the low 90s to the upper 90s today at least 95 in Colfax, 96 degrees in Alexandria, 95 in Oakdale, and 93 degrees in Bunky. So we are above average once again for today. But with those wind speeds shipping out of the south, moisture will be increasing throughout the state. So we'll be dealing with increased dew points as well. And that could fuel a few isolated showers, even scattered thunderstorms coming up for the rest of this week. Dry air mostly towards the west as a cold front uh, moves in towards the east. So with those dew points uh, right now in the lower 60s that does increase to at least upper 60s and 70s by the end of this week highest dew points coming up by Friday very muggy out there especially with rain chances on the rise now it does decrease just a little bit for the weekend but still be dealing with humid conditions both Saturday and Sunday so those rain chances at zero today 10 percent for tomorrow and then back up again by Friday then it'll start to decrease a little bit by this weekend but the best chance of rain is Monday of next week associated with a cold front they'll be pushing through but still on the low end side for those rain chances but we'll need a lot more days of rain to help us out with the drought monitor but as far as those rainfall totals for the next five days highest will be in parts of northern texas oklahoma and arkansas but as far as here in louisiana only up to at least a quarter of an inch or even half an inch in our western parishes so we'll take any rain that we can get to help us out with the drought but for today only a few clouds passing through for this afternoon most of the rain fall stays north uh, in North Louisiana even for a Thursday morning sunny skies once again just a few passing clouds by the afternoon hours but it'll be a pretty dry day coming up tomorrow as well and taking a look at the tropics Hurricane Nigel a category one hurricane was a category two earlier this morning those sustained winds had calm, calmed down to 90 miles per hour and it's still moving towards the north at 18 miles per hour so it will stay out in open waters and remain a category one hurricane now through the rest of this week before it becomes or transition to a um, tropical or extra tropical system by the end of this week but we also have other disturbances out there as well one is off the coast off the east coast they'll bring in heavy rainfall for the carolinas gusty winds and dangerous surf but we also have a tropical wave that we're keeping an eye out that's likely to become a tropical depression or even tropical storm coming up by the end of this week or this weekend so with that seven day forecast, pretty decent highs in the upper 90s today and tomorrow, 94 by Friday. And the first day of fall on Saturday with a high of 93 Saturday and Sunday. Rain chances or the best rain chance Monday at 40 percent, all due to a cold front pushing through Joanna. Overnight temperature is steadily increasing into the low 70s by this weekend. So the seven day forecast is uh, it's OK, but mm -hmm. um, I would like a good rainy day. We haven't had one of those in quite a while. Right. So we've got temperatures going down, but at the same time, we really need that rain. Yeah, we do need the rain because because that drought is is not looking good. And that drought report comes out tomorrow. Tomorrow, the, the end of the week is already here. All so right. tomorrow morning for midday, we'll see that new drought monitor. All right, and that first day of fall on Saturday. Yes, cannot wait. It'll still Not be pretty wait. hot, but uh, that means the gears are turning, so temperatures decreasing a little bit coming up. All right, Brianna, thanks so much. Mm -hmm. You're welcome.